How can you recognize, or what's the difference between a good guitarist and an excellent guitarist? I'll say right off, an excellent, excellent, excellent guitarist excellent. will take you on a ride with them where you just kind of lose, you don't think about where you are or your environment, you're just carried off with the music. And that takes years and years and years to get there. Mm. So a lot of the older guitar players are sometimes the best at it, you know, and younger players are more headed towards technique and trying to impress people. Mm. And it does for 10 or 15 minutes. But, you know, as, as far as the overall adventure, um, the great guitar players, there's a reason that they're known as that great. Mm. Thanks. I think if you, if you break that down and you say what, what makes a musician or a guitarist be able to take you on that journey, for me, some of the, the elements in there are, uh, of course, there's a sense of flow, there's a sense of ease and grace, there's a sense of enormous uh, uh, sensitivity, but also uh, dynamic range. Um, so, but, and, and then there's something beyond all of the techniques. There, I think it's a grace, really. It's, somebody wrote it recently. Once you have done something for so many times, for so many hours, for so much time, you reach a point of grace with it, hmm. where it's completely effortless. And, um, and it's, I think that's, that's what makes a really great artist. Of any kind. Uh, for you both, is the guitar just a piece of wood or is there something more in it? I think you leave your funk in it over the years. <laughs> you know, there's, there's something about it's an organic material and you spend thousands of hours with that. I think there's, it's almost like some of your spirit transfers into it. Mm. I think, I think of my guitars, okay, so I play acoustic guitars and, and maybe it's a different feeling with electric, I don't know. But um, the guitar when it's, before it's your guitar and it's just a guitar, it has all this potential, you know, but it's a little bit of a blank with a lot of potential. And then you start to play it and you change, you change it mm. and it changes you and you change each other. And um, every instrument has its own energy, its own sound, but also feeling and, and everything. And so it really, for me, becomes a combination of, of this conversation that we continue to have. And so the instrument is always changing and growing together with Person. I forgot your question. Did no, I no, answer no, it? You're, you're answering my question. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. uh, talking about the guitars, yeah. um, is there anything that we could call love at first sight? Sure. But sometimes it can fool you. Mm. Mm. <laughs> yeah. Uh, because it's more than just sight. It's sound and it's feel. It's, 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 uh, it really, for me, is all of those things. And um, so you have to be careful. <laughs> Love at first sight. Mm. Yeah, I think it's the same with humans. You see somebody that's very attractive, and they could end up being a complete waste of time. <laughs> <laughs> I specialize in those men. <laughs> Uh, but it's been the same with the guitar. There's been a couple love at first sights, and I don't own those guitars anymore. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. All right. Thank you very much now, for now. And now I would like to ask you to play a little bit. It's up to you who will start. I already played. Hey! <laughs> <laughs>